everyone! So someone has recently brought to my attention that I have never made a cosplay vlog before or a progress vlog on what I'm working on. So uh, basically I'm going to try making one of those today. So please excuse any frivolous errors I make because I've never actually done one of these before. So I am in the spare bedroom of my house which I have turned into a sewing and cosplay room. As you can tell from the sewing machine, uh, the dress form, and on this side all of my cosplays, which are alphabeticalized, by the way. Anyhow, the outfit I am making is a TARDIS Lolita dress. I'm doing the one on the right, which I think is outfit B, maybe? I don't really know, but it's by, it's by Simplicity. I got the pattern from Joann's, and it was actually on sale. Speaking of Joann's, they had a huge sale on Doctor Who fabric, so we picked up a bunch of it literally bought out most of the fabric they got because we were there like the day after the fabric was released. So we have this, we also have um, blanket things, I made one of them already, and we have exploding TARDIS fabric. Basically we're going to be making some pillowcases out of the more softer fabric, I can't remember what this is called, and then out of this one I'm going to make a skirt and hopefully some hair bows and bow ties, because bow ties are cool. Well, these are the fabrics I'm using for it. Not this, I'm making a skirt for that, like I said. But there's the navy blue, the exploding tortoise fabric, and then this really nice cream color. Uh, this one is cotton, and I believe these two are actually made out of broadcloth instead. The actual dress I'm making now is the tortoise Lolita dress. Hopefully you can see that it's made out of exploding tortoise fabric. And I've started the top of it, sort of. I haven't really gotten that far. I haven't been able to work on it since I've been really busy. Currently, I just have the pattern cut out with all the fabric. I messed up on the sleeves, though. I started cutting on the wrong line because I, I don't even know why. But uh, all these are cut out, so basically all we have to do is piece them together. Only I ran out of black lace and blue ribbon, so... We will need to get more of that, I believe. That's the bordering of it. It's this dark blue, navy blue, TARDIS blue ribbon. And then I have some really nice lace on top of it. Just like over here. That's the top of it so far. By we, I mean that my mom is actually helping me with this. She used to own a quilt shop, so she's like knows a lot about sewing this stuff. And I'm not exactly sure how to make sleeves. <laughs> Uh, she helped me on my Alice in Wonderland cosplay with the sleeves because I had no clue what I was doing with those. Uh, but yeah, so hopefully she will help me with those and with the pendulum skirt because I'm not sure how to finish that off because I really don't feel like doing it by hand. But uh, this outfit was supposed to be done by like April 26th or something. It was supposed to be done for C2E2. But obviously that did not happen, and so yeah, we're gonna try to finish it before school starts in like a week. Well, that's where I'm at so far for this project in particular. Uh, following this, I have a pattern I'm going to be using for Gadoka, if I can actually ever finish that. Uh, that's my Alice one. And I have another one over here. Oh, nope, that's the renaissance dress thing. Bella made one of those. It turned out really, really nice. But I do have a pattern over here for Elsa and Anna from Frozen. So after this, I really want to make an Elsa cosplay. We're really late for the bandwagon, but uh, I still love her. And I'm dyeing my hair platinum next. So yeah, but anyways, I hope you at least kind of enjoyed this video. Um, I'm not exactly sure how to make a vlog, but yeah, I tried. Thank you so much for watching, and hopefully I'll make another one of these when I actually have this finished or close to being finished. But yeah, thank you. Bye.